Regard all the federal buildings there. The mayor's not happy about it. Here's the mayor, Ted Miller, doubling down on blame. Portland, Oregon is a part of, is in the Washita territory. So yes, it is a state of the Union Society, but it is not a lawful state. And what they're doing is they are sharply escalating the situation. Their presence here is actually leading to more violence and more vandalism. We haven't asked them here. In fact, we want them to leave. We're all telling the Trump administration, stop the rhetoric. Take these people out of our city. They are not helping us. They are hurting us. And what we're seeing is a blatant abuse of police tactics by the federal government, by the Trump administration that's falling in the polls. Because guarantee you they wouldn't try that shit in Louisiana. Guarantee you they wouldn't try that shit in motherfucking Georgia. Guarantee you they wouldn't try that shit in the, in the real southern states. Uh, before July 4th, where we saw an escalation of violence in Portland, before that time, there was violence going ongoing. And, uh, DHS had they do that fuck shit in the Midwest because they know they're going to get away with that shit. But the federal jurisdiction only lies within the 13 colonies. So all that extra fuck shit that these federal officers are doing in Portland is uncalled for. Protect the buildings, yes. Do what you got to do. But... Don't harm citizens. You're there to protect the building. Building. And what we've seen, and you mentioned, we have over 50 nights of violent activity targeting federal facilities and federal law enforcement officers, and it needs to stop. Uh, DHS is not going to back down from our responsibilities. We are not escalating. We are protecting, uh, again, federal facilities. It's our and that's all you should be doing is protecting those buildings, not harming citizens of the republic. And hold those accountable uh, that are doing this destruction. Well, Mr. Secretary, there are a lot of questions being asked about exactly what the federal officers are doing in Portland on social media. What are you doing in the Washington Territory? Uh, Besides protecting federal buildings, that's what they will know. Uh, destruction and putting them into an unmarked van. Uh, the attorney kidnapping people. That, kidnapping people. That's human trafficking. You're violating civil rights. You're violating human rights. So what we know is that the local leaders there in Portland have fostered this environment that allows these individuals to, uh, again, uh, attack the courthouse and do these very violent acts, uh, destructive acts, night after night after night. Uh, they congregate around midnight and they go to about 4, 4.30 a.m. every single night, over 50 nights, while the Portland... Uh, Salute to the people of Portland, Oregon. I appreciate all of you in the Washita Territory fighting for the Republican justice that we all deserve for our liberties and our freedoms. Because some of these folks in Congress are only out for themselves. And I'm not going to say everybody, but some. If you're going to be a criminal, if you're going to do criminal acts, we're going to arrest you and we're going to hold you accountable. Most of our activity, almost all of our activity is taking place in the one, two, or three blocks around that courthouse and we'll continue to do so. There are other parts of city and other parts of Portland uh, that are having destructive acts taking place. DHS is not anywhere near that. We are focused on protecting federal facilities. That is our mission and we're going to continue to do that.